Okay, so in the beginning of the video, I would like to just say if, if this video gets 50 views in the first week or 5 likes in the first 24 hours, I'll be making a CSGO competitive video. So yeah, please get me 50 views or 5 likes if you want to see a CSGO matchmaking video. So yeah, and enjoy the video. Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Perplex, as usual, and in this video, I will be showing you how you can make images look 100% more vibrant and darker and more HD so they look better with Photoshop CC. So, first of all, you open up your Photoshop and you find an image. So, let's just look for a CSGO um, a dust to background. And make sure it's 19 by 180 pixels, so it's 180p. And once you find an image, make sure it's 19 20 by 180 pixels. And go on and go on view image. Then you go right, click save image as, and put it on your desktop or whatever you want to save it. And make sure you have a 1920 by 180 background so it will fit. And then now you drag in the picture that you just found and you save it. And then you might make it a bit bigger so it looks better and then just resize it and make sure it looks good. Now yeah, now you're going to make sh and now you make sure that you're highlighted on the image then filter and then this right here and now these are my settings so the contrast is plus 50 shadows are minus 20 now this is your preference so like so like and if you add motion blur, then make it be negative 30. And if you don't want motion blur, then just make it be plus 20. Now, for the vibrance, it should be around plus 6 for both of these. And then you go on a Okay, and as you see, it is already a lot brighter and it looks a lot better. So now you adjust it with curves. And in my opinion, the best one is around like here. Um, it's uh, so what I did, I just put it a bit down, and that's it. Next, you want hue and saturation. So, what you do is you lower the lightness by like 5, and you raise the saturation by like 10. And, and as you see, we went from this to this. Then it's already a lot better. So, now if you wanted motion blur, you go here, blur, motion blur. And you make it around like 50, but I don't really want motion blur, so I won't do that. And now the last thing, what you want is these white lines that I always have in my thumbnails. It just always looks really good. Like, just look at this one right here. That just makes it pop out a lot more. Okay, so how you make that, you have to make another layer. Then you make this little box, it's not really big. Just like that, and then you go on your brush tool and make it white and make sh sure it's actually rash tries and you go on it like once and then you duplicate that and you drag it for the other side. 
do that again and then I'll make sure it's a negative 90 degrees and you go ahead and put it like this now I duplicate it again and I drag it to the bottom now you combine all these t together by merging them and you make this either soft light or overlay and now you merge it and make sure it's on overlay as well so this is how you can make an image look 100 percent more vibrant more colorful more detailed and more hd thank you for watching i've been purple and, and i'm out bye guys